Hello, this is Blue Star, Defender of Equestria, and this is my next Blind Reaction video. My Little Pony Tell Your Tale, Pony Parade Modium. Yay! It's a parade! Yay! <laughs> In the last episode, Izzy was looking forward to celebrating Harps and Hooves Day. Unfortunately, the rest of Maritime Bay was uh, not quite so excited and uh, makes me think this episode was almost written by a single person. <laughs> so I guess overall the moral of that episode was that, yeah, real relationships take time, but are ultimately worth it in the end. So, uh, and Zip got a... Uh, Somewhat scary Venus flytrap. Um, I'm sure it'll be okay, but don't get any ideas, Venus flytrap. I've got my eye on you. So, uh, this episode appears to involve all the main five, and in some ways I should wear Izzy's hat, but since I wore her hat last week, I shall wear Pip's hat and see what happens. <gasps> A parade! How exciting! So, time for the next episode of Tell Your Tale in... Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> mm. Ha! Nice. Oh, do, uh, you need my own car, but these costumes are totally spectacular. Ah! Uh, they'll be great in the uh, pony con parade. Uh, Stuck. They are um, a little big. Oh, oh, yep. oh dear. So every pony can see Sunny? us and know how equally hashtag pony perfect we all are. Okay. And equally itchy. I'm all itchy. To dance <laughs> right. In that parade. <laughs> <laughs> if Pitch can rehearse around all his peacekeeping and share with thing, we all <clears throat> can. Right, Hitch? Where is Hitch? Where's Hitch? Where, where is he? Oh no, we've lost Hitch. No. Snip, slot, snip that head a lot. Okay. <laughs> Nice! That street should be so clean I can eat my dinner on it! Yes, sir! Uh-oh. Look out! No! <laughs> what? Nice! I say! <laughs> nice job. Atta boy, Kenny. It's gonna be a good day, Sparky! Oh no, it's Misty! Did you follow all my instructions, Misty? Uh... Sure did! One batch of blazeberry buns! Fresh from the oven. Okay. Oh, the blazeberry. One snip hmm. brings out a critter's inner beast, which means chaos for them and plenty of dragon fire for me. Oh. And a cutie mark <laughs> for me. Oh. Hmm. Her voice has changed. <laughs> oh dear. Oh no. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh no! Snacks are on it. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, Sparky, hope you're not coming down with something. We've got a parade to march in. Uh, Darn it! Ah, and we are so late! <laughs> Critters, let's roll out! Crit Critters? Uh oh. <laughs> They've turned evil. Uh, uh, Critters? Critters? Are you okay? Uh oh. Uh, well, Sparky, we should probably. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it may not be the dragon fire I asked for, but at least it's entertaining. <laughs> oh, good! Ruined without hitch. <laughs> well, good news. Uh, uh. Say hello to Senor Butter Hitch. Oops. <laughs> I oh can dear. Fix that. It's not yeah. like Hitch to be late. No. It isn't. No, it isn't. Don't, I won't let anything ruin your parade, sis. <gasps> but I thought you didn't care about this stuff. If you oh. care, I care. Oh, how nice. Oh. Huh. Um. Where is every pony? <laughs> Running. And what is all this orange stuff? Hmm. Okay. Blazeberry? Oh. No. Uh oh. Oh no. Ooh. I just wanted to make Pony Kai Parade special for our friends, but nothing has gone to plan. Yeah. Oh no, got the donut. Oh, you want this? Sure. Go fetch. Here, have the donut. Uh oh. Feeding frenzy. And now uh -oh. we know they're hungry. Great. Great. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> Looks like you critters need to blow off some steam. <laughs> Charge! <laughs> 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 
Oh, oh dear. <laughs> ah, take that! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Maximum power! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What do I do? Why are you asking me? This is your mess. <laughs> Bye, you're on your own. <laughs> thanks, thanks a lot, Opaline. Oh no! Run, Misty! Oh. Phew! At least we can get back to the parade like nothing happened. Oh dear, I see. Yeah, there's a bit of a problem with that. decorations, but trash is good too. <laughs> right. <laughs> it's all oh. I wouldn't be so sure. Critters, really? Yes, sir! Oh, well, that was easy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Hmm. And as always, thank you to hard work people who are so hard on the show. Rawr! <laughs> Bye! So that was Parade Ammonium and... Mm, it was kind of weird, but I guess what else is new, but I liked it, so... <laughs> there was actually quite a few things going on here. I mean, first, we obviously have this parade to begin with, and I did like that bit with, uh, you know, Zip and Pip, where it's like, I thought you didn't like this stuff! It's like, you know, in some ways, I don't, but it matters to you, so it matters to me, so... Aw, that was nice. Hitch and the critters and that, you know, the critters are actually taking in some ways a lot bigger role in actually helping Hitch. That instead of just being like, hey, give Hitch some space, it's like, hey, critters, could you go and, you know, help me with this? It's like, oh, that's kind of interesting. Um, I do have to say, actually being able to talk to them and actually being able to understand them, I think was a bit of a help with that, so. <laughs> we had Misty and Opaline, and it was sort of an interesting idea that they were trying to do. It's like, oh, we'll, we'll give them this dessert that will make them sneeze and breathe dragon fire, but unfortunately, by doing the dragon fire, oh, he turned it into a donut, so plant foiled. Aw, oh, uh, bad for Misty, but good for us, so. <laughs> Oh, I feel really bad for Misty in this episode, as I usually do, to be honest. Misty, yo, tried to do this plan, and she followed Opaline's instructions, it didn't work out, and then when things are really going bad for uh, Misty, Opaline basically, like, okay, this is your best, bye. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Opaline! <laughs> well, she is a super villain, after all. It's what she does. It was kind of weird what happened with the critters, because it's like, um... I think they're hostile now. What do we do? <laughs> I did like how they were able to actually resolve that. It's get your hair dryer. We're going in. <laughs> I think this is the first time that a hair dryer has ever successfully been used as a weapon. Uh, uh, sort of, I guess. <laughs> in any case, overall, I kind of like this one. I mean, it had some sort of interesting character stuff going on. We had a return of Misty and Opaline, and we had sort of a funny thing with the animals, and uh, overall, I thought it was good, and I liked it. <laughs> so, I hope you enjoyed this video, and as always, thank you for commenting, liking, and subscribing, and until next time, this is Blue Star. Stay strong, and pony on. Blue Star out.